Whoops, I just realized that I had the microphone muted. Hello. Up this way. You check it out. I'll wait here. All right, sit tight. So I am continuing my playthrough of Uncharted 3 on crushing on, mode. It's clear. And I'm doing this because I wanted to play through it again um, before the movie comes out. Because the Uncharted movie is in theaters in the U.S. starting tomorrow. And I'm going to go see it after work. So I just kind of wanted to I'll climb up and around. refresh my memory. Let you in if it's safe. All right. And also, of course, get some trophies. Whoa. You okay? Yeah. <clears throat> Close though. This is the only Uncharted game on the Nathan Drake collection that I still haven't gotten the Platinum in. So I'm hoping to work through that. That's why I'm playing it on crushing difficulty, honestly. Normally I would just play on normal. Jesus Christ. Oh my god, that scared the shit out of me. I didn't even... I didn't know there were so many people. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm dumb. Shit. Already? Just what I... Here. God. I apologize. I'm really bad at this. <laughs> Shit. Already? Just what I needed. How did they only just now notice I, I was doing Literal gunshot. <laughs> they are very nice suits. Yeah, I guess this is some like tourist area in. Where did they go? Israel? I can't remember where Chloe went, but. Oh, so actually, I had a, a strange thought that I wanted to run by y'all and see how you feel about it. So, um, we got him. I have a, a snack. I got some reduced fat Pringles because I went to the store and, and got some snacks because I, I just love snacks. But I got some reduced fat Pringles because they were the same price as the regular Pringles. And I was like, why not? Why not be healthy? Whatever. And they taste the same, like indistinguishable from regular Pringles. So my question is, if it's this... Oh, there's more people down there. Yeah, I'm really bad at this. But my question is, if the reduced fat Pringles cost the same as regular Pringles and taste the same as regular Pringles, then why wouldn't the Pringle company just make the reduced fat version the normal version. Like, why... Why not just make the healthier one the default? I don't understand, because nobody would choose the reduced fat version... Uh, like, 
the reduced fat version probably sells less. But that's because people assume that it doesn't taste as good. But if they just make that the default, then people are healthier. I just don't understand. Why, why would they... Why wouldn't they just do that? Why not just make all of their products better? Make them all reduced fat. I don't understand. So I'm, I'm having this, like, crisis in the middle of the grocery store because I'm like... I'm like, why don't they just choose to make the healthier option? I don't get it. I don't get it. Shit. Oh yeah, I wonder what makes it less fat too. Like, just what I needed. Cause I don't think it's, like it can't be more expensive to make because it costs the same. Unless they're just thinking they can offset that with the sales of the regular Pringles. But even still, It just, that thought, it, it like crept into my brain and it, it wouldn't leave. I, I couldn't stop thinking about it. Oh my god. Shit. Already? You know, I was trying to <laughs> just what I beat this game. To <laughs> I don't think I'm... <laughs> yeah, I always have to... Oh. oh, Jesus Christ. Okay. Oh! It could be the oil, but again, yeah, like, why not just make the same as we... Yeah, it... Like, if I, if I were a company... <laughs> If I were this non-human entity, uh, but no, if, if I if I owned a company and like there was an option to make my product I see him. just as Finished. good, it wouldn't cost more, and it would be better for my my customers. Like, why wouldn't you just do the better option? And then you don't even have to put reduced fat on the on the can. So it wouldn't deter anyone from, uh, from buying it. Like, you could literally just have it say, like, new and improved. Or whatever. Or you don't even have to say anything at all. You can just keep it a secret. But I would, I would make it a whole PR thing. I would just be like, oh yeah, our product is now healthier for everyone, and it's going to cost the same. You're welcome. Like, why wouldn't you do that? It kind of irks me that <laughs> that they don't, honestly. All right. Come on, it's clear. Anyways, I've got my reduced fat Pringles here. What the hell you been doing? Uh, the usual. Come on, help me with this. Whoop. Maybe they make more per can on the regular, and they just bite the difference on the less fat ones because if they cost more or less, people will buy them. Come on, this way. I mean that's fair. You better hurry it up. Maybe I'll. Should I call them? <laughs> should I ask? I wonder if I should. Sully, over here. Like a regular can costs 15 cents, 0.15 cents to manufacture, but less fat costs 0.20 cents. I mean, we have to get to the bottom of this. Oh, he's Lower going me down. down. All right, I'm going to mute my mic while I eat Pringles. Um, so I might down there? pop in and out. Yeah, give me a sec. I'll check it out.
Who's there? Nobody's here. Please don't hurt me. Oh. God. Ooh, a treasure. So, random fun fact about this game. Um, so, the main character is not super strong. Um, he's not particularly... Like, he's actually kind of clumsy. Uh, but, um, the reason why he does so well in fights is he actually is just extremely lucky. And uh, he's so lucky that when uh, the screen starts to turn red, it's actually not blood. It's not him getting hit with bullets. It's to signify his luck running out. So if you were to watch this game in slow motion, whenever enemies are firing uh, at the main character, the bullets do not hit the main character. They like will whiz past him. And as your luck runs out, uh, basically as, um, as you do worse, I guess, in the game, the bullets will get closer and closer and closer until eventually one bullet hits you and you die. So, uh, yeah, the main character is not a not some Back bullet sponge or luck. anything. He just has um, really good luck, and whenever you die, you didn't get hit multiple times. You just got hit by one bullet. Kind of neat. It's like a small little detail that I think is pretty cool. Sully, help me out. Well, that's kind of what he does throughout the game. Uh, he keeps betting on all these grand this treasure hunts and Chloe adventures. And be in real trouble. Where the hell could they be? But um, without diving into the story too much, in Uncharted 4, um, that's kind of a big part of this is he uh, he questions whether it's worth it because while he might be lucky, his luck may be running out. And the more that he goes on these treasure hunts, the more he might be hurting the ones he loves because he's dragging them along. Like this game is a lot about his relationship with um, Sully. Now he might be putting Sully at risk. Wait, why? Uh, well, the Talbot ambushed us at the chateau. It was a trap. Yeah, we figured they must have followed you, too. Well, yeah, they're definitely here. <laughs> yeah, no kidding. So we might want to think about keeping it down a little. Uh, what happened to you two? We've been trying to reach you for over 24 hours. Oh, right, I need to top up my minutes. You're using a prepaid phone? Mate, those contracts are a complete ripoff. <laughs> what? Mine's broken. Again? Look, just forget all that. You'll never guess what we've discovered. I've got it all in here. <laughs> Not only did Elizabeth's spy network stretch all the way over here, but they were all part of some sort of hermetic secret society. The British Occult Secret Service, the School of Night, the Hellfire Club, the Order of the Golden Dawn, they're all connected. So John D And Francis Walsingham, and Walter Raleigh, and even your mate Drake, they were all in on it. But for them, it was all about the power. Controlling their enemies through espionage, deception, fear. Hey, guys. Wait, 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 wait. So Marlowe and her crew are the same secret order 400 years on. We cut to the goddamn chase, please. Yeah, we really need to keep moving. Sure, sure. Here, look. Quad est superius. Est secret quad est inferius. 
As above, so below. That's the key to all of this. We need to get to the highest point of this castle. <laughs> Thus, the stairs. Well done. We should be able to find our way into the crypts with this clue. The entrance has got to be hidden here someplace. There, that's the highest tower. Okay, so we just need to make our way Look across. Out. Oh shit, bollocks! Get down! Now what? All right, the only way to the tower is through them. Great. Whatever happened to that sneak in, sneak out plan? You what? We can't quit now. Yeah, not when we're so close. Come on, we'll find a way around them. <laughs> They're here. We just have to find them. Just wait till they get their hands on Cutter. Oh. What about the other two? Now they're done. Talbot finished them up in France. Oh, there's a guy right there. Honestly, it's amazing that I've gotten this far. <laughs> I play a lot of video games, but I'm not good at <laughs> video games. Nobody's here. Continue about your business. What's that? How? How did he see me? Shit. I thought it was just the one guy and then other people came out and... It's not an excuse or anything, I, I did bad. I made bad choices. I'm really excited about seeing the movie tomorrow because even though I know it's not going to be exactly like the games, which is fine, it's just exciting to me that I'm seeing more, um, more content related to the things that I love. Like, and that makes me excited. I should have stealth, but I don't know what I'm doing. I just got excited, I guess. Mom. <laughs> I'm doing great, I'm doing great, I'm doing great. Right, every time I die, I'm gonna eat a Pringle. And... Every time I get to a cutscene, I'm going to eat a Pringle. I am not sponsored by Pringle. Though at this point I should be.
This game came out two generations ago on the PlayStation 3. It's crazy to me. Because I think it still looks pretty good. Oh, God damn it. Head down, head down. I don't think they saw me. I think they saw... What's his face? What's his name? Cutter? I think it's Cutter. One more guy. No, the music went away. Nope, yep, there's one more guy. Why did the music go away? There's a trap. There's an entrance at the base of the tower. Well, let's head to the top and see what we've got. How do I get at the top? In those stairs. Clever. Gate, perfect. Charlie, give me a hand with this. The music did lie. You through? Yep, clear. Got it. Right, down. Come on, follow me. As if I know where I'm going. I just went in a big old circle. Oh, there's treasure. Where did it go? There it is. Oh, it's a horse. It's a headless horseman. Oh. Up this way. Oh! Those are bad guys. Jesus, I thought those were my people. What? How did I mess that up so bad? Oh no. It's gonna blow up. No! Got him. What is going on? There was no music. Come on, follow me. If an enemy sees you, usually the music kicks. Is this like a glitch? Or is it just trying to psych me out here? Up this way. It's right after I say that the um, game holds up well, and then it has to glitch out on me. I could help. Yeah. Why is there no music? Like, you don't notice how weird it is until it's gone. God. How am I still alive? Okay, thanks guys. Jesus Christ. This scared me. Why do I get scared so easily? You're done. Oh, hold on. I know this is bad timing, but I'll be right back.
hey, i have to go.